Right, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. Before I start, I want to give all honors and glories and praises to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Yahweh Kachwadash, Yahweh, which is the only true name of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shai, who the world eagerly calls Jesus Christ, but his one true name is Yahweh Shai. I would like to give double honors to my elders and apostles of Great Millstone because those are the men who I've learned this truth from through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Peace, blessings, salutations to the hopeful elect. And shalom to you, sincere brothers scattered abroad, pushing forth this word in truth and sincerity. I am the brother Mashiaka Razaka from the servants of Yahweh Wai Yahweh Shai Camp, Las Vegas, Nevada branch. And I pretty, pretty much, um, this individual has been bugging for the past couple of days. All right. Rumor has it, I've been told that this individual only been in the truth for three months and he's already causing confusion. He's already slandering and scoffing the men of the Lord. All right. He has a particular doctrine set up where he believes that you don't have to follow camps and that you don't need to follow you no know, uh, follow prophets of the Lord. He believes in his own understanding that you could get this truth on your own without even, um, you know, following any men, without looking on YouTube. You know, you could just read the Bible and get this truth. But I damn sure know that your ass was following Great Millstone. Now, he put a video up yesterday and he's calling Great Millstone saying that those of us that are followers of Great Millstone are, are guys that's in GMS to brothers that are under the banner, because we're under the banner of Great Millstone. We're not in Great Millstone, but we're under the banner of Great Millstone, meaning what? We teach the same exact doctrine and and uh, teachings as Great Millstone teach, all right? So, you know, to the camps out there that's under the banner of Great Millstone, like ourselves, we follow all the instructions given through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Shai through his men, because Great Millstone has 100% truth. But this dude is calling us... Um, Basically saying that Great Millstone is our heroes because we follow them and because we uh, teach the same exact doctrine as them or to guys that's in GMS. He's calling all of us, even us, uh, that Great Millstone is our hero. So I'm going to play the, the scoffing shit that he's doing and then we're about to go into the scriptures. And before I do this lesson, so lock your elders and brothers out there for the rambling in this video. Um, <clears throat> before I came into this truth, all right, the only individual... Um, that knows this, knows me personally, and this individual know me before I even knew of Great Millstone was Hawashai Zion. You can talk to that brother. Any brother in GMS can talk to that brother. That brother knew me before I even started following Great Millstone. All right, and I was bugged out. I was saying Israel and all type of shit, but the Lord sent that man. All right, that brother. All right, to direct me into this truth. All right, and. The Lord Yahweh Bashim Shai, through the Spirit, directed me, directed that man to me, to get me in order, and to fall in line. All right, and if it wasn't for the Lord speaking through that man, I wouldn't have even known a great millstone. I wouldn't have known of the Lord's name being Yahweh. I wouldn't be learning that the name of the Heavenly Father is Yahweh, or His only begotten Son name is Yahweh Shai. I wouldn't even understand the breakdown. I wouldn't even understand break, break basic breakdowns, man. All right, so there's no way that your ass. This dude, I'm going to go back to this dude, that your ass learned the truth without following prophets. There's no fucking way. All right? And uh, Salaki about that, just had to bring that testimony out because I learned this truth. I'm, I'm going back to 2015. I'm talking about before I even knew of Great Millstone. How was Shai Zion, that brother, directed me into the truth. All right? And I learned uh, through the spirit of Pauly Haobashi Mashai, I learned from that man, that from that brother, man. All right? That brother directed me in the truth, all right? And the only way you can seek the Lord is through men. It's basically what I'm saying. You have to follow men. So let me just play this video. I've been rambling. But this is what this bugged out individual stated. Hey, Shalom. Ko haloyim la. Yahweh bahashim yahusha. Barakatah Yahweh. Barakatah Yahusha. Barakatah Rakakudash. I just wanted to show y'all something real quick, right? These are y'all heroes, right? Great Millstone. This so he's he's saying that Great Millstone is our heroes. That's what he's saying. So these are y'all heroes, right? Great Millstone. Okay, you being a you being a damn jackass. That's what you that's what you're doing. 
All right? You being a damn jackass, the Lord going to destroy your ass, man, if you don't get your ass in order, man. These are your heroes, right? Great Millstone. This is the kind of spirit that your heroes is in. All right, check this out. You know, this is a brother, you know, um, sharing his testimony. He's saying that he rebuked his mom and dad. And he used to follow GMS. Now they believe, you know, that we're the Israelites and Yahweh Shah, Malak Shah, Malak, Malak Shah, Malak him. You know, there's only way by grace, you know, which is a beautiful thing. Look at this, look at this brother from GMS, GMS Holland ZX. You a double minded man. Hold on real quick. You a double minded man for following one and then not. This shows according to your own words that the Most High was not with you. Oh, well, you follow GMS, but now he is. So now, so you just admitted that he was not with you when you follow GMS? Like, no. All he said was that, you know, he rebuked his mom and dad. You know what I'm saying? When he used to follow GMS, you know? Meaning, at a point in time, you follow GMS, you know? Or around the time he followed GMS, that's when, you know, he passed the knowledge down to his mom, mom and dad, you know? And now they believe. That's all he was saying. And look how smug and look how smart this nigga's getting, man. GMS Holland, GX. You know? And, you know, I, this is a comment. This is a comment left on, on a brother Awa's uh, uh, page, you know, and that's the brother Awa responding to this jerk, GMS Holland, you know? And he's going back and forth. And then I had said something, you know, you just coming out brothers on some salty ish. And it definitely sounds like it, because brothers are waking up without GMS, you need to eat a Snickers because you bugging. And that's the truth, man. Yo, you know his brothers out here? You know his brothers out here that got called into the truth by angels? Do you know that his brothers out here that got called into the truth by Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shaham? And my first question is to you, since you're saying that brothers don't need to follow Great Millstone to get the truth, how did you get the truth? That's my question to you first and foremost. How did you get the name of Yahweh Bahashim Yahshua? How did you get the breakdown of the name of the Lord? How did you get the breakdowns? How did you understand and keep the law, statutes, and commandments? How was you able to do all that? You did not read the Bible like a novel and understand all that information. All right? There's, there's no way your ass did that. All right? And then he said angels. Okay, angels are messengers because we know that word angel means messengers. But who, who are the angels? We're angels, man. All right? We, we're, in, we're trapped in these uh, 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 carnal bodies in the chambers of darkness, but we're angels, man. Those messengers are the prophets, all right, who are the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, for one. So, you see, this is a bugged out individual. He don't know what he's talking about. He doesn't even know what the hell he's talking about, all right? And this is, a, again, I've been saying this for years. Elders and apostles of Great Millstone have been saying this years first and foremost, but I've been saying this for years. Again. You guys out there that be, that learn this truth, that get one week uh, up to six months, you need to follow only one camp. Follow Great Millstone Hebrew Israelites, all right? I don't know if this dude is following different groups. I don't know if this dude maybe follow Great Millstone, took the doctrine, formed his own way, and now he's against it. I don't know what this individual is about. But one thing I know is that he's bugging. And we're going we're gonna to rip your ass up in the scriptures because he's basically saying that you don't need to follow men, all right, to be able to seek the Lord. And elders and brothers have been doing lessons on this stuff for uh, years, man. So let's, let's go into the scriptures. How are you going to be able to seek the Lord, man? How are you going to be able to seek the Lord? You can't, how are you going to be able to seek the Lord, man? All right, and we're going to, um, it's like it. He, the scriptures gives us instructions, man. It's common sense. The scriptures gives us instructions. 1 Corinthians 16 11. It says, seek the Lord and his strength. Seek his face continually. How are you going to be able to seek the Lord's face continually? How are you going to be able to do that? All right. By following who? His prophets. Because the only way you're going to be able to seek the Lord is through his men. 
The only way you're going to be able to seek the Lord is through his men. Who are his men? The elders and apostles of Great Millstone. The Lord set those men up for you to follow. So you are to fall in line, fall in line, learn under those men, because through those men, you're going to be able to what? Receive salvation through those men. The Lord already has men set up. So, yes, you supposed to follow Great Millstone because Great Millstone has 100 percent truth. Number two, my second question is to you, because you said that a lot of Jakes have woken up into the truth without Great Millstone, uh, without Great Millstone. So you could be right because you got groups out there that's under the banner of Great Millstone like us. We're servants of Yahweh, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai. There's seven branches of us and we all teach what? The same exact doctrine of Great Millstone. We're not in Great Millstone, but we're under the doctrine of Great Millstone. And we teach the exact same thing because Great Millstone, they are our parents. All right. In the spirit. So we teach the same doctrine as Great Millstone. So you may have brothers that might wake up into this truth uh, of, of brothers that's uh, from, from other camps that's not in Great Millstone, but they teach the same exact doctrine, though. All right, so we're not, we may not be members in Great Millstone, but we're products of Great Millstone because we learn from who? Great Millstone. So you, 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 if you're stating that issue, you're right. But if you're stating that you could just read the fucking Bible on your own and get your own interpretation of it and then teach it the way you want to and you could just wake up into the truth on your own, you're wrong on that. Because there's no way that any individual, including myself, I've been in this truth, it'll be seven years for me next month. I've been in this truth since 2015, fall of August of 2015. If Hawashai Zion never rebuked me, I never would have known of Great Millstone. And I admit it, I've been in this truth almost seven years. I'm not boasting. I thank the Most High for keeping me in the truth that long. But if the Lord never sent that brother to me to rebuke me off of one, off of one word, I never would have known of Great Millstone. I've probably been like that individual, fucking bugged out. All right? Because I didn't even know of Great Millstone in 2015. I didn't know of Great Millstone. All right. I didn't. And, you know, you just got a lot of these bugged out individuals. All right. That's just saying and speaking their own things and doing their own things. All right. But, hey, you have to follow men, whether you believe in it or not, whether you agree with it or not. You have to follow men. The Lord always have men set up. <clears throat> this is uh, Psalms uh, 34 and 10. This is a perfect scripture. It says the young lion do lack and suffer hunger. And who, who's that talking about? These two thirds, that individual there is clearly a two third. All right. Because he, 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 he ain't getting fed the truth. This dude is fucking bugged out saying, oh, you ain't got to follow Great Millstone. You can get this truth basically on your own. That's what he's saying. So you a young lion that you that young lion that do lack and suffer hunger. You don't have the truth. It says, but they that seek the Lord, anytime you see Lord in caps, talking about the Heavenly Father, how are you going to seek the Lord? His men. It says, shall not want any good thing. Because what? You, we got the truth. We follow Great Millstone. We follow those men. The Lord set those men up. All right? We, we seek those. We seek the Lord. And the only way we can seek the Lord is through his men, through his prophets. Let me see if we can get some more scriptures out, man. Uh, I'm just going off the top of the head, which I can read. Let's see if I can get uh, get another scripture up. Mm. Uh, let me see what else I can get. Uh. Here it is. Uh, here it is. Isaiah fifty, Isaiah fifty five and six. Salakia, seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. Right? How are you gonna seek the Lord? Seek. It says, seek the Lord while he may be found. How are you gonna be able to seek the Lord? You can't just read the Bible like a novel. You, you YouTube is set up for what? To be able to get the truth. A lot of Jakes is waking up all through the world, all throughout the world. A lot of Jakes is waking up. How are we waking up? Because of the prophets. All right. YouTube is basically a, a, a site created from the Lord through the spirit so that is, the Israelites can be woken up throughout the four corners of the earth. All right. And Great Millstone is spread. Great Millstone is, is, is everywhere, man. You, you, got, you got brothers that's teaching the same doctrine of Great Millstone in Nigeria, all throughout the world, France. Britain, British, Britain, all over the place, man. 
You got Jake's waking up all over the place. So what you talking about? Uh, Jake's ain't waking up. Uh, Great Millstone ain't. Uh, uh, brothers ain't well. Brothers ain't waking up following Great Millstone. There's Great Millstone is waking up. You got brothers waking up from Great Millstone all over the world, man. What are you talking about, man? You are fucking bugged out. Isaiah 55 and 6. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found, and call ye upon him while he's near. Right. So you supposed to seek the Lord, and the only way you can seek the Lord is 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 what seeking his prophets, following his men. All right. The Lord have men set up that always been. The order set up by the Lord, man. All right? Because the only way you can seek the Lord is by following his men. And those men are the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, man. And this is, uh, that's Amos 8 and 11. I would get that out, but that's, you know, going into the famine of the word, which will take place if you don't get this truth. All right? So you are supposed to follow men. So uh, let me let me let me get out. Um, I just wanted to pull some scriptures out. This is um, Luke one and seventy. All right, because <clears throat> the only way you can seek the Lord is to follow men. The Lord always have men set up, regardless if you believe in it or not. That's the only way you're going to be able to seek the Lord is is from His prophets, His men, and those men are the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. They have the hundred percent truth. All right, Luke one and seventy. It says, as he spanked by the mouth of his holy prophets, which have been since the world began. The Lord always had men set up. That cuts everything your ass is talking about. The Lord always had men set up. Luke 1 and 70. As he spanked by the mouth of his holy prophets. Who are his holy prophets? The elders and apostles of Great Millstone. The Lord is dealing with those men on a high spiritual level. Regardless if you believe in it or not. The Lord always had men set up. You have to follow men. If regardless you believe it or not, you have to follow men. You cannot get this truth on your own. All right? You cannot get this truth on his own, on your own. I never got this truth on my own. I follow Great Millstone. I watch all their lessons. I took notes. All right? I, I never would have known again. I would never would have known a Great Millstone if, if, if the Lord never sent Howard Shai Zion to direct me to the truth. I never would have known a Great Millstone. I followed men and learned from men. What's, what's, what's wrong from learning from men? It's all in the scriptures. The Lord said it right here, Luke 1 and 70, as he spanked by the mouth of his holy prophets, prophets is what? Men, men, Israelite men, which have been since the world began, since the world began, the Lord always had men set up. So all you guys out there that are saying that you don't need to follow camps, you know, you can get the truth on your own, you're going off. Because this scripture said that the Lord always speak through the mouth of his holy prophets since the world began. The Lord always had men set up. All right. And you got to follow men. Now, when I say follow men, I'm not talking about follow anybody. I'm talking about the men of the Lord who are the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Because those men have the 100% truth. And you need to follow those men. Because through those men, Lord willing, you're going to what? Receive salvation. You want to follow those men. All right? This is uh, Matthew 10 and 20. For it is not ye that speak. It is, see? For it is not Elder Apostle Tahar, Elder Apostle Gabar, Elder Apostle Ramlub. Elder Apostle Raka, on down to all the elders and apostles of GMS out there, on down to the sincere brothers like ourselves, that's under the banner of Great Millstone, all right? It's not us that speak, for it is not ye that speak, but the spirit of your father which speaketh in you. And starting from Elder Apostle Tahar, Elder Apostle Gabar, Elder Apostle Ramlap, Elder Apostle Raka, on down, the Lord is speaking through them. That's not them that's speaking, it's the Lord speaking through them. So when you bulk up against the prophets and you and you boast up and bulk up against the prophets, bold up against the prophets and get to scoffing and talking shit, you boasting up against the Lord, man. You bucking up against the Heavenly Father, man. And you're going to be fucking destroyed for doing that. That's what you Jakes are not looking at. You, yeah, you. You can be destroyed for doing that. Yeah, you. I'm talking to you, nah, nah, Nahariah, Yahawada. If I'm saying your name right, you're going to be fucking destroyed. Because your ass is scoffing. You've been bugging out for the past few days, man. You're going to go on Instagram, post a comment talking about uh, speaking against Elder Apostle Har on his lesson. All right. About the MOTB. Now your ass is doing this lesson saying uh, these are your heroes, Great Millstone. You are a fucking bug out. And if you don't get your ass in order, nigga, you're going to be destroyed. And we're going to destroy your ass. Because there's a lot of you bugged out individuals out there. You only been in truth three motherfucking months. All right. 
You only been in truth three fucking months, bro. You do not know shit. You are a, a fucking baby in this thing. You need to you need to take this fucking video down. You need to take this lesson down first and foremost. All right? You need to repent and you need to get your ass in order. We are in the last days. All right? And this is what a lot of you Jake's not realizing. We are in the last fucking days, man. We're way too fucking close to start fucking bugging out. You only been in truth three fucking months and your ass is already fucking bugging out, bro. You need to take this fucking video down. All right, this video that you got, these are your heroes, Great Mill. So you take this fucking video down, or the Lord gonna fucking kill your ass, man. You gonna be destroyed, cause what you fucking doing? You're scoffing. You're being a damn demon. All right, you being a damn demon. You've been you've been bugging out for this past couple of days, man. And it's it's getting crazy. All right, I don't know if this guy's an agent. I don't know what he is, but he gonna be fucking destroyed if he don't take this goddamn video down. Yeah, you gonna be destroyed. Lord gonna fucking kill your ass, man. Cause you 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 you're going completely off, man. You are going off. You bugged out. You are going off. All right. You are causing confusion. All right. You out there trying to deceive people, tell people not to follow uh, prophets, the prophets of the Lord. You're scattering the sheep right now, man. According to Jeremiah twenty three and one through three, if you you you're scattering the flock, man. You focus boasting up against the men of the Lord, man. You are gonna be fucked destroyed, man. You see, and this is what I said. You Jake's out there. Y'all don't examine yourself, man. I don't examine yourself at all. But this fucking individual, do not follow this guy. He's a fucking bug out. All right? He's been bugging out for the past couple of days. He's been fucking bugging out. Do not watch this dude. Bug out alert. Follow this damn guy. You're going to be destroyed with him. Don't follow these individuals. This guy only been in the truth for three fucking months. Rumor has it. Three fucking months, man. All right? You already fucking bugging out. You only been in the truth three months. And you fucking bugging out. This is why, again, this is scary, man. Because the Lord can he, can, he can fucking bug your ass out within months. This guy's a fucking bug out, man. All right? So, hey, man, I'm in there with that. Lord, one is that since that fine. I want to give honors and glories and praise to you. Howa, Baha, Shemi, Hashai, Baha, Shemi, Kakutash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Peace, blessings, salutations to the hopeful elect. Shalom to you, sincere brother, scattered abroad, pushing forth this word in truth and sincerity. I'm the brother, Mashiach Razaka from the servants of Yahweh, Yahweh, Shai Camp, Las Vegas, Nevada branch. And Lord one is less than Zedifying. But hey, man, this dude is a fucking bug out. Watch this guy. He's a fucking bug out. All right. Avoid this guy. He only been in truth three motherfucking months. All right. This dude only been in truth three months. He's fucking bugged out. Stay away from this dude, man. All right. Shalom.